Brad Hall here, and today I am customizing the Yeezy Foam Runner. It is going to be my most challenging custom project ever. I don't know if it's gonna work out, but I sure hope it does, and I hope you stick around to watch. Now before I get into this custom, I do wanna let you know about this shirt that I'm wearing right now. It is a very nice shirt and it is available in my store, so go check it out. I'll put a link in the description. If you're on the fence, I would like to point out how versatile this shirt is. It's a short sleeve shirt, but as you can see, it does look great with long sleeves under it, so you can wear it pretty much all year round. Now let's get into this custom. The Foam Runner, it is coming out this week, supposedly. I was planning on testing the comfort, finally wearing the Foam Runner out into the world, but I got a little bit worried when I saw this sole. And you can see it's all foam down here. I was very worried about that durability. I thought, is there any way to fix that issue? And I think I came up with a really good solution. I am going to reinforce that sole with the sole from this pair of Skechers. So I'm gonna take this and put it onto this kind of a shoe graft of sorts. My plan is to remove this upper completely. Then once I have it off, I am gonna kind of plop that on there with a lot of glue, let it dry, and then I should have that reinforced foam runner. So that is the sole. That's gonna be the upper. Since this is a very difficult custom, I am gonna start with a fake pair of foam runners. This is the pair from my Realverse fake video. If I ruin this one, I'm not gonna lose any sleep. So hopefully I won't ruin it. And let's see if we can make this a reality. So I am very happy with the finished product. They look very futuristic. The Foam Runner, already a futuristic looking shoe. Now it looks, it looks that much more forward thinking. It kind of reminds me of that funky Nike shoe, at least in this heel area where it's got this big opening. So very cool looking, but of course the most important thing, it is very practical. You are gonna get really great durability with these. If I had to pick something that I would improve on this, I do wish it had that black strip around the midsole. I thought that would give it a little bit better one-to-one -one fit, but I had to cut that off just to get it on there. So that's pretty much the only thing I would do differently about this. Now there are different ways you can make this foam runner more durable. If you come up with one of those ways, please let me know. I'd love to see what you come up with. And thanks for watching.